Good morning. So we're just getting ready uh, with some food. We're going to be going down to the pool. Uh, we got some friends coming over, so we're going to be throwing some kebabs and some burgers on the grill and hanging out by the pool, having a good day. Uh, we got a little things ready. So we got some mushrooms. Let's cut up that onion. Working on that bell pepper. Got the chicken marinating over there. And just getting ready. So our friends are here. Say hey, Joe. Hey. It's, it's it's fucking noon somewhere, so cheers. It's yeah. not fun to drink along. Five o'clock somewhere. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> White people in your five o'clock. Mexicans, <laughs> it's noon. <laughs> really? Just grilling up some kebabs that we made. Yeah, we, take up the we have everyone here. Right. And we have our little and setup over here. No so right now we're just cooking. We haven't really gone swimming. I think only the guys have. But it's been a little bit of a hectic day. But so far so good. My truck just got towed today. It did. It ain't stopping me though. <laughs> yeah, that's what was Eric the hiccup driving, in Eric today. Eric driving home. I see. Yes. We're playing Uno. Got Uno. motherfucker. Wow, wild that shit? She said. <laughs> you ready? You ready? Uh, you ready? Remember that? Yes! You like this? Yes! You like this? Yes! Yes! You yes! Yes! Hey, good morning. So it's Monday and it's like 5.45 in the morning. I'm down here in the gym all by myself. Oh, what are you down here this early? Saying it. I'm taking this pretty seriously. I want to train. I've got a few more sets to do and I'll go upstairs and get ready for work. So I'm at work right now. Today is April 21st. Um, Sebastian turns two today. And uh, I don't know how many of you out there are parents or not, but if you are, then you know that amazing feeling it is to be a parent. And Sebastian, happy birthday. I love you with all my heart. And I'm already so proud of you. You're such a stubborn, independent, smart little boy. And uh, you're, just, you're just the best thing that's ever happened. Happy birthday, Sebastian. Hey guys, so I'm driving. So I'm gonna look this way. But I just got out of work and I have to go get gas because I always procrastinate to like, I'm on empty, and then I'm like, all right, I guess I'll get some gas. But yeah, so I have to get gas. I hate getting gas after work, because like all I want to do is get home. But then I didn't feel like going this morning, because I wanted to buy like a gas gift card um, at work, because you guys know I work for a school, and so if like I buy gift cards through the school, like the school gets a rebate on all the gift cards they sell. So I, recently started doing that with everything like that I can think of like Albertsons um, Target I bought one for Target I bought my dad's birthday gift card there and I bought my gas one so I'm gonna go get gas and I've never used a gift card at a gas station so I'm I don't know we'll see how that works and I think we're gonna go out tonight to dinner cuz I feel like I've been my cooking has been off all week like all um, like when was it a few nights ago like I made I was gonna make pork chops and potato gratin or gratin I don't know how you say it but I was gonna make gratin I don't know but I was gonna make that so you know I had my pork chops grilling and then I had the milk and the cheese mix boiling for the potatoes because I just bought like the box kind that you just you know like throw everything together and I burnt the milk like who burns the milk I had the milk like on to boil and I turned around and I started washing a few dishes and then I turn around and I go to like mix and it was like black like just lifted up the bottom I was like god dang it so I burnt the milk and then I was like well then I'll just make a little bit of pasta but I only had enough pasta for one person and like with me and Jonathan like I can eat rice like every day like I love rice but like he doesn't like he likes it but he doesn't like it like I like it so I didn't want to make him rice so then I was like well I'll just make him a little bit of the the little bit of pasta we have left like a quick butter pasta um, and then I'll make me some rice well I feel like everything was salty like I feel like his pasta was salty because I use like garlic salt and I think I put too much and then the pork chops were so And then the pork chops were salty. I mean, they were okay, like they tasted okay, but they were salty, like they were salty. 
I just got to the gas station. I've been talking for three minutes. I hope I didn't bore you guys. And you guys are on my little like phone stand thing in my bob that I have. So it's hands free. But yeah, I'm gonna see what all this whole pumping gas with a gift card stuff is like. Well, I guess I'll finish my story. So yes, it goes that I just feel like my cooking's been off this week, like all week. Like it's either too salty or I don't like it. So I'm like, uh, we just have to go out to dinner because it's just not working out. We have to go for flights. This is our daily workout. Officially home. That's my little key. So we're trying to figure out where to go to dinner and this is always a struggle. Always a struggle. Because somebody always makes me decide by myself. <laughs> so we don't know. We don't know where to go. I was like, Panera! And he was like, no! You didn't even say Panera. You had the whole conversation by yourself. You're like, let's go to Panera! And then you started talking like me in my voice. Because apparently, I talk like this. Tell me, and you decided like, that I didn't want to go there either. And then you were like, why do you always pick places I don't see, like? See? <laughs> There's that voice, apparently. Well, yeah, because time. I'm trying to make it sound like a man. So I have to make my voice deep. So we don't know where to go to dinner. And then we have to go to Target, too. Why? Why do we have to go to Target? Because I have a Target gift card. So why do we have to go tonight? Because I need stuff. Deodorant and stuff. Shampoo. Shampoo. Didn't mean to tell you. You can't smell. Whatever. I never smell. Even if I don't wear deodorant, I don't smell. Please. As the person laying in the bed next to you, there's some smell Stop. emanating Have from I you. ever smelled? Honest to God, have I ever smelled? I'm not going to answer this question. No. <laughs> in your face. Dom, such a liar. Okay. What a lazy. Fuck I'm over shit. here ready to go into the lady. How long have you been laying here? I just got here 10 minutes ago. How long have you been laying here? Call me lazy. Like that shit. You've probably been here since three. I wish. You know what the real problem is? The real problem isn't that we're so indecisive. It's that we have too many fucking choices. And then we never know where we want to go. And we like Perhaps. a lot of these places. So, and they're all nearby. <clears throat> That's our real problem. Mm -hmm. It's great. That was the solution. <laughs> go get him. You've been in bed longer. I'm vlogging. Vlog as you go get them. I hate him. <laughs> it sucked. Their Chinese food wasn't all that great, and their sushi was sucked, and it was super overpriced. Yeah, the sushi did wasn't good, but the Chinese food. <coughs> Chinese food was so we got this in the mail, and it has a bunch of coupons for a bunch of places. So I think that's gonna help us. I don't think it is. Make our decision. You think it's oh look Shogun. So we came to the Red Lobster. And we hadn't I had we haven't been here in a long time and I love this place. And I'm craving shrimp. So I got my favorite mark. I think this is my favorite alcoholic beverage anywhere in the world is the Red Lobster Pina Colada. So good. It doesn't taste like alcohol, it's mainly sweet, but I like it. What's the dilemma? All right, so you got the shrimp either what way, which I can do like three kinds of shrimp that I like. That sounds good. They also have the combination, which would be kind of cool to do like fried shrimp and salmon. That sounds really good mm -hmm. with the choice of a side. And then they also have the $17.99, where I would get like a soup, a salad, an entree, and a dessert. I just feel like it's gonna be a really small for me. So I'm not sure what to do. Struggle. My target. Great. Oh, target. and I need shampoo. We're at so here, we're at Target. It's all melancholy. <laughs> the heck with you? That's what I've been using lately. I have a bunch of conditioner though. Is it even recording? <laughs> The funniest thing. Okay, I'm just like nothing funny happened. What else did I need? Deodorant. Deodorant. Oh, stink. Whatever. Set the refill. So mean. So mean. I don't know where it's at. So mean. It's like I'm at Target by myself because somebody's always 
on their phone working. Hurry up! Makes me so mad. It's like he can't wait to do it tomorrow when he gets to work. He has to do it right now. <sighs> hey guys, so we're driving home. We just got done at Target and I got one of the new L'Oreal, I don't know, infallible lipsticks or something. I don't even know what it is. I feel like I'm so behind on new makeup that's out. I feel like I'm so behind on like makeup that's out. Like I don't even know what's going on. But yeah, I decided to pick that up because I saw it on the display and I really like the color. And I've been wanting like just a pink lip color. But anyways, so yeah, we're heading, oh, Angie just texted me. We're heading home and we wanted to ask you because a lot of you guys, Jonathan's here with me. A lot of you guys have been asking questions and asking me to do a Q&A video on the vlog channel and on my main channel. So leave in the comments in this video if you have any questions for me and Jonathan, if you want us to do a Q&A. If we don't get a lot of questions, I'll probably just answer them in the comments. But if we get like a good number of questions, then we'll do like a separate Q&A video. So yeah. Anything you want to add? Nope. That's all for now. See you guys later.